Hey guys, it's Filmer. Um, I'm just doing uh, another commentary, and I'm gonna. I started this one a little later than what I when I usually do um, my commentaries. But for this one, this one is a uh, CTF game on the drift, and this is by Cozy. And the account he's using is uh, Cozy is bad. Um, he totally isn't. Uh, this dude is pretty fucking good. Um, he uh, wanted me to. Uh, Put this video up for him, and uh, it's actually a tryhard game. It's really good. Um, I was really impressed by uh, the gameplay that he actually gave me. I'm pretty psyched that um, he gave me this gameplay. But uh, he's actually he's playing with uh, X Raptor, Red Dragon, Samuel Jackson, and uh, Psychor. And uh, I've been playing with Psychor for like the first uh, the first like two weeks of this game coming out. He's really good. Um, they're playing it against, uh, Disclaimer, Please, Asian, Game Sager, Siphon, or, uh, Purple Haze. And, um, I think the, uh, the Game Sager and Siphon, those two guys I know are really good. I know Asian's good, I've, I've played against him in Reach, um, he's really good. I don't really know too much about Disclaimer and Purple Haze, but, uh, I know, I know they're, uh, they're pretty good too. Um, Game Sager and Siphon are probably the most popular. Um, out of those guys that I know, I mean, I, th I think they're, I think they're pretty good for, uh, for playing Halo in general, um, all these guys are actually really good. This game actually kind of becomes a close game. It's kind of long, so that's why I kind of, like, cut it short a little bit, but, uh, other than that, um, it's solid gameplay. There's a lot of good stuff going on around this, uh, around on this map. I actually don't like this map too much, but uh, it looks like both of them are uh, have uh, two people carrying the flag, and I think red team scores first, and then blue team, but once somebody has, yeah, so red team just scored, and and uh, blue team's uh, scored too. So, I mean, I'm just gonna, like, I don't, I don't have that much time to put all of the commentary up, so I was only going to put up a little bit, but I'm going to try and go as far as I can without it getting ruined. Uh, usually when I, was, when I first did, this is like the second, my second commentary I did because the first one got, got messed up, and it's because I'm only allowed to have 15 minutes on YouTube, so it kind of just screws me over. But uh, I've I'm like studied this a little bit and just watched it a bunch so far. Like this is probably like my fourth time watching it, I think. And and Cozy doesn't make too many mistakes. He wanted me to talk about uh, what he did wrong and stuff like that. Um, I didn't really want to. Uh, I mean, it's really good. I, he made like a couple of mistakes here and there. I mean, it's it's really not that that bad. It wasn't a, it wasn't bad enough where he actually cost the a loss and because in this game he actually wins I probably didn't like should have not said that it's a spoiler but whatever uh, I'm not like saying that you shouldn't just stop watching it because the gameplay is just really good and uh, I, I think everything he's doing is pretty good actually what's really good is how he's using is a Promethean vision he's using it really well and um, he just knows. He just knows what to do right now in, the, in uh, these kind of situations. He's just uh, sitting back with a uh, with Promethean vision in the uh, lava hallway, and uh, he's just using it really well. It seems like everybody's needing the shit out of him, but he's uh, pr pr he's pretty much protecting that red flag, and he's doing whatever he can. To, uh, protect it. it seems like all of blue team is just uh, sitting back right now because they know that they've already kept two flags and they only have one so they're gonna try and stay on defense while pretty much all of red team is gonna do off is gonna do pretty much all offense um, cozy's not gonna push anymore on the on that on that side at least I don't think he is but he's doing it anyways. <laughs> See, they're all camping back there. They're waiting for him, so they can use the bolt shot. And no one's gonna come out yep, and finish him off. 
That's some good teamwork for blue team, that's for sure. Um, LG didn't really have much, couldn't really do much. He was by himself, so that's why they pulled out like that. So it looks like he's gonna have to, uh, he's on the other side of the map, so. And there's two people, so I wouldn't even try, but he's got somebody with him, so that's good. Purple is, is chasing him, so he, he's getting the fuck out of there. But it doesn't matter, he dies from, uh, I think, Blue Attic. There's not much going on there. Uh, for this map, I think the best way to control this map in Slayer would be having Ring his top control, like, I don't know what you call that, ring 2, or whatever, but this is capture flag, so, uh, they're, they're just gonna have to push as a team, he's kinda just by himself right now, I don't know, like, I mean, he's got his teammates on the, on his uh, radar, but be, for a while, like, before, he was just kinda soloing it, and that's kinda what I do, but it's the worst thing ever, cause in this game you can't, you can't be by yourself, you always have to be with somebody because this game is like, more like Halo 3, you kinda have to be with people. You can't, like, I mean, you could sprint, but I just feel like you can die so much easier in this game. I think Cozy's just trying to pick people off right now. I don't know how he died going up that uh, staircase, but uh, shit happens. I had to cut out a couple of death screens, so I hope you guys are not really offended by that, but to save time I had to do that and I had to cut out all the crap in the, the beginning and like, you know, it's only like 15 minutes and it's really not that long and this game is like 15 minutes and 19 seconds long, so I kind of have to like wait for all that crap and, but anyways, uh, I kind of was procrastinating on this uh, commentary, like, I did it like a week ago, but I don't, know, I don't know what's going on with Final Cut. That's the program I use, and it's just not registering. If I was cozy, I'd drop. He's got two guys on him. Yeah, he dropped. Go a different route. I don't know why, like, I feel like nobody dies for me in this game. And they're all pushing right now. Yeah. Yeah, Cozy's one shot. They're all pushing to the right. They know that these guys are one shot. They're not even gonna chase them. They're just gonna go. Cause there's just instant respawn. So just push them back and have them have no shields and be afraid of dying and then just push away from them. I think is a I think it's a good tactic, but uh unfortunately it's not really working too well. When uh I I don't even know how, but like so many uh yeah, I think, yeah, Red Dragon capped the second flag, and those guys did it so fast that I didn't even, like, after watching this the fourth time, they did it so quick I barely even noticed. So, they did a really good job, like, sneaking in that second flag. I mean, once you sneak in, like, one flag, the other team's gonna sneak in then too, because as soon as you have it, they're gonna go grab yours. So, um, I've noticed that a lot in, like, serious tryhard. Uh, capture flag games, they usually do that. They usually like if somebody has their has your flag, then you have like two people, maybe three people, uh, go kill that person, and then have their fourth person go and pick up that flag or push two, push in twos. You can do that. Um, but now these guys are are trying real hard to just get get a uh, red team's flag, and Cozy's not letting that happen. Now, Cozy's kind of like by himself. I would just run. He could probably throw a nade. Yeah, he's out of there. That's what I would do. He's got nobody with him to uh, clean push or kill or anything. Now, this is like the part that I can't do. I can't kill anybody with a, a goddamn fucking bull shot. I'm terrible with that weapon. I don't know why I'm so bad with it. Promethean Vision actually works the best. My maps are really small, like really tiny. Um, Abandon's good. I think a drift is probably the best for using this. Uh, I usually use invis. I don't know if it's really that good, but Promethean vision like kind of messes with like how I see things. Like 
I know you can see through walls and shit like that, but this, I think it's just annoying for me, at least. But, I mean, that, that's just me. None of these guys have, like, stealth on. None of these guys have... I think, yeah, Siphon's the only one that has Invis. Um, but anyways, uh, these guys are, uh, they're still trying to push. Game Stager gets, uh, he gets destroyed right there. He couldn't really do much. And I don't even know how Siphon didn't die there, but Siphon gets an amazing nade and kills Cozy with it. He obviously died later, but I don't even know where that grenade came from. He must have threw it off the box or something. I don't know how Purple Haze is not dead there, but he, he just dies. So, the best, I think the best strategy is always have somebody with you or you're with them. Like, this game, the best strategy is to run in twos. Always, always have, like, if you're one shot, have your, your other teammate pull out and kill that, and, like, finish up that person if he can. And if he can't, then... Even if you're one shot, I'm always told that when you're one shot, poke out anyways just to help team shoot that guy. And so I don't really like that idea, but you know, maybe I should start listening to people that are way better than me and do that. Um, but anyways, it was kind of funny that uh, uh, Cozy tried to rush in there and pummel uh, whoever that was. I already passed, but. He actually ended up dying doing that. That little area right in that like that like hallway is pretty good area to stay. But because he's got the flag, and there's definitely somebody coming that hallway at A1 or whatever you call it A3. I don't know. I hate the call house in this game. They're they're terrible, you can't even tell. I would have went up the other way, but I don't think Cozy could have done anything. There was somebody behind him too. So Red Dragon throws in another flag and it looks like blue team's already on to the second flag, already trying to uh, carry that thing. There wasn't much Cozy could yeah, there, like, Cozy couldn't really do much right there. If you see, like, there was somebody in Blue Attic, and these guys are already running for for the second flag, and I actually think they do cap it. But if they're capping it, then Red Team's gonna have a flag. Like, if one picks up a flag, if one team picks up a flag, then another's gonna pick up another flag. So it's just, it's just pretty much determines on who's gonna cap it first, but who's gonna kill the carrier. I think first. If you if somebody kills the carrier first, then you can easily just cap it and not like really have a problem. So here's like the fourth cap. This is definitely the fourth cap right here. Yep, there it is. Fourth cap. There's only like about a minute left. There's like a minute and a few seconds left, but no. I don't know if uh I don't think there's gonna get another cap in here. Cozy was getting like pretty much triple team. There wasn't much he could have done, but that doesn't matter. I mean, even if blue team takes flag now and caps it, they still have, they still have like, I guess you could say like about 40 to 35 seconds left, but I wouldn't even, I mean, you're not going to do it. These guys are trying super hard to win, and I was just like, I think what they did right now is pretty good. They have, um, about 30 seconds left. Oh, well, less, way less than that. Sorry. And uh, it's four to two. They could just cap and get four to three, but it's not gonna happen. This game is uh, pretty much over. It's really, really good gameplay, and Red Team pushed so hard to get that flag in, and they did a really good job, I think. Um, these games are pretty damn like close to being like what MLG gameplay is, but. I hope you guys enjoy that. They're not pros, they're just kids that are really good. Um, hope you guys like all that stuff because I'm going to be doing way more Halo videos.